Hey, what's going on, guys? It's your boy Happy bringing you the latest and most up to date information about Square Enix. Stick around because I have great news! I'm so flattered! Okay, guys, so for a while now, we'll be bothering Hajime Tabata about a certain little thing. I'll tell you guys exactly what that is in a second. Just for right now, I want to talk about Moogles, okay? Moogles have been around in Final Fantasy for the longest time ever. Mario Wiki, of all places, says here, Moogles are a species originating from the Final Fantasy series made by Square Enix. They have appeared in almost all Final Fantasy games and since became the series mascot. The first appearance of a Moogle in the Mario series is in Mario Hoops 3 on 3, which was likewise developed by Square Enix. Also, we have here, Moogles, these mysterious beings tend to flock around humans closer to men than beasts. They communicate via their network magnet and their distinctive cry of Kupo and fluffy appearance and dear them to all so basically a moogle has been the mascot for final fantasy moogles have been around for a long long time i remember my first moogle that i ever saw was in the final fantasy 7 there's a summon in final fantasy 7 called choco slash mog and is this what you're seeing right here it's a pretty cool summon and that's the first time that i ever saw a moogle because final fantasy 7 was the very first final fantasy that i ever played however moogles have been around ever since final fantasy 3 and final fantasy 1 and 2 there was no moogles it started final fantasy 3 then we skipped 4 and then ever since then we have had moogles in almost every single final fantasy they have been like yeah like a mascot to final fantasy and even in the movie having children we can see right here they have a moogle as a doll he wasn't in the actual movie but he was still a doll you know and that's pretty cool moogles are also known as mod so why am i talking about moogles so much today i am personally a big fan of moogles i always love moogles and i honestly been bugging hajime tabata about moogles now i know i'm not the only person in the world that has been bugging him about it but Ever since Final Fantasy 15 came out with the demo, I got a chance to fill out the questionnaire at the end of the demo. It was optional, you know, you could do it if you wanted to or not, but I decided to go on and fill out the questionnaire and it said, you know, if any additional comment and my additional comment was that i wanted to see moogles in final fantasy 15. so apparently there was a tweet by hajime tabata as of recently and there was a three-part tweet and it reads as follows and get excited for this because this is very very exciting hi tabata here congrats moogle i like to thank everyone that voted i will think of a fun little way to feature moogles in final fantasy 15. importantly at this stage of development i will not be making a trade-off with other work remaining in order to fit them in so it won't be a very chatty moogle but we'll be done with suitably light level of development work as a fun little ff15 extra so finally 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 guys although we were not gonna get moogles in final fantasy 15 our perseverance and <laughs> And I'm pretty sure all the tweets and everything that everybody said, the director Hajime Tabata finally got to him and he finally decided to put Moogles in. Granted, they're not going to be like in Final Fantasy IX where you had the magnet or you had, you know, the actual Moogle that was safe for you or, you know, tent with you. We're not going to have any of that stuff. He's going to incorporate it in his own unique way. So I can only imagine like which way he's going to incorporate it in the mini game or maybe in a card game or something. I don't know which way he's going to incorporated but the ideas that are flowing through my head right now are so many that i can't even tell you guys but i would really like to know what you guys think in which way do you think that hajime tabata will incorporate this moogle if i had to take a guess again i would say that he'll incorporate it in a way like near a safe point or something like that you know something not too bright or like too crazy like that yeah maybe he'll make moogles like be safe points or something like that you know what i'm saying i don't know but i honestly don't know so that's why i'm asking you guys your opinion what do you guys think that hajime tabata will do with the moogles oh my god i'm so excited though i'm finally really really excited that we're actually gonna get to get them i really did not think that we were ever going to get moogles between you guys and me <laughs> All right, guys, so that's basically all I wanted to talk about for today. Remember that the way that you can support this channel is by simply liking this video. Your likes matter a lot. The more likes this video has, the more it goes out to the community, and the more it goes out to the community, the more people can see it. So like and share this video if you can. And remember to subscribe to the channel for the latest and most up-to-date information about Square Enix. Ratata, have a nice day. I'm so flattered.